When DeMarcus Beasley takes the field in Cleveland against Belgium, he'll become only the 13th U.S. men's national team player to reach 100 caps. Amazingly, Beasley has appeared in at least one national team match in every calendar year since 2001, a testament to both his longevity and his character, traits very much appreciated by his teammates and his head coach. I think of DeMarcus Beasley as, as an absolute exceptional professional player. I mean, uh, obviously he, he has given an enormous amount of talent. You know, he's versatile, he can play left, right, midfield, back line. Um, but also his personality is just, uh, it's just a pleasure to, to have him with because he's always positive, he's always pushing, he's always curious. Um, and, uh, and that's why he's getting to that huge mark of 100 caps. You know, I, around like 92, 93, you know, I thought maybe I'd get a couple more, but I never thought I would, you know, get eight, you know. You know, it's tough to, to get uh, national team games. You know, it's not easy. You know, it doesn't, it doesn't uh, just come to anyone. You know, you have to earn it. You have to, you know, you have to want it for one thing. And, you know, you got to be playing well at the moment. So, you know, it all went into, um, it went into play when I went to Mexico and, you know, Having a, that opportunity at that time, you know, basically helped my career uh, get back to where it is now. I'm just proud of him, you know, playing uh, playing so much with Bees. And, and when I was coming up um, as, a, as a young goalkeeper, obviously Bees is younger than I am, but he was already a superstar for the national team. And, um, you know, it was him and Landon flying down the wings. And it's just great to see good players stand the test of time, you know, and, and consistently. When you get 100 caps, you've, you've done something right for quite a long time. Um, and, and it's a true testament to... Uh, to him kind of rediscovering himself and, um, you know, just really finding his niche down in Mexico and uh, getting in good form and, again, like I said, just proud of him. To be able to play in that many games for your country is a, is a great achievement, great accomplishment, and, uh, you know, I'm proud of him, you know what I mean, because it hasn't been just straight through. You know, he's had to, you know, he started off really strong and then fought his way back into the team and is performing really well, so, uh, you know, happy for him and, uh, you know, it's definitely something I hope I can accomplish one day. It's a tremendous achievement playing 100 caps for your country and I, I hope he's going to enjoy this moment uh, because he deserves it. He deserves to be part of this group. He deserves it to go towards Brazil 2014 and, uh, and we are thrilled for him. The most I feel is a little bit mixed. Um, obviously more exciting than anything else um, but you know uh, at the end of the day it's, it's still another game and a game that we, we want to win and you know, continue to, um, uh, you know, play well going into our three World Cup qualifying matches. But, yeah, I mean, I, at the end of the day, I, yeah, I'm very excited about the, the milestone, uh, about playing 100 games for my country. You know, it's truly, truly an honor to, to represent my country this many times. And, you know, I, I feel great that, uh, you know, I'm, the old man is still, still around.